Hello and welcome back to Vanguard Motor Sales. My name is Tom Fotios and we're standing in front of a gorgeous 57 Chevy two-door hardtop black beauty here, guys. Don't forget we ship worldwide, so don't hesitate. We can put your dream in your driveway no matter where you are. Please download the 7 Dennis Mistakes by going to ClassicCarBuyingSecrets.com. And also, don't forget at Vanguard, we own our inventory. These are not consignment vehicles. So we saw these vehicles as worthy of our inventory. Uh, so we've already done all the inspections. Coming up and let's take a look at this beautiful car. This vehicle was owned by the same person for about eight years. Um, beautiful, black, straight, solid car. Um, it has a 350 in it, AC, and uh, just a beautiful, beautiful 57 Chevy. The interior's uh, silver and black. Beautiful interior, we'll get to that as well. Nice white wall tires and very nice chrome as well. Let's open up the trunk here. Beautiful trunk with the uh, spare tire, jack and everything as well. Nice and clean, solid. All the chrome in the back is beautiful as well. Going down the passenger side, you have the same beauty as the driver side. Absolutely beautiful, clean. Don't forget to join us on YouTube, Twitter, and Facebook by going to VanguardMotorsales.com and become social subscribers in the right hand corner to Twitter, Facebook, and YouTube. Let's check out the beautiful interior. Nice, clean, solid door lips. That's where they always rust out first. Beautiful black and silver interior. Just a dynamite two-door hardtop, guys. It's got a beautiful painted black dash. Uh, pretty well stock in here. It has an aftermarket um, uh, AC unit. Just a beautiful car, guys. Don't miss out on the rare opportunity to own a two-door black 57 Chevy. <music> All right, now we're underneath this 57 Chevy. Real solid under here. Looks like it's got some original undercoating. Well, at least some really old undercoating under here. Everything looks real tight under here. We've got um, period correct rear end. It is not a posi. Looks like we got a couple new brake lines here. Frames in great shape. Floorboards look good. Again, they've got that old undercoating underneath there. I don't see any replacement back here whatsoever. The um, body mounts all look in good shape on this car. Moving our way forward, it does have duals on it. The mufflers are in good shape. This pipe is uh, definitely uh, got some rust on it, but it all looks like it's in good shape. No holes in it whatsoever. This thing's got a uh, turbo 350 trans. They've adapted a uh, cross member, it looks like, out of a Camaro. Got it all welded in real nice. Real nice job on this car. Looks like some new tie rod ends up front here. Looks like we got some new flex lines, new springs up front. The uh, front suspension's definitely been rebuilt. Looks like new bushings up front here. Um, new ball joints. Really nice job on this car. Looks like the... Uh, Oil pan was chrome at one time, the chrome shining through there on the bottom. It's got some orange paint on it also. We've got a chrome uh, closeout panel here also. These bumpers look like they were redone at one time. I see uh, they're nice and clean on the back. Looks like they just came back from the plater a few years ago. Beautiful job on this car, real solid underneath. We've got some original uh, wide whites, uh, bias ply tires here. You know, these tires are uh, seven and a half by 14 uh, bias ply tires. Real nice looking hubcap still on this car. So this is a small block in this thing. We verified the numbers. It's got a Griffin 
um, aluminum radiator, which you guys that know cars know that that means money. Griffin radiators are fantastic radiators and you got to pay for them. Uh, this car does have air conditioning on it, uh, vintage air, condenser here. We've got an external uh, electric fan there to keep that uh, condenser cool. Uh, nice Edelbrock aluminum intake. Some real nice uh, chrome valve covers there and chrome air cleaner. It's got a um, Edelbrock carburetor on it. It's got a chrome alternator. Looks like the master cylinder was recently replaced. Now this car does not have power brakes or power steering, but the way the steering is geared on this thing, it steers just fine. You wouldn't know it didn't have power steering. It looks like the uh, hood hinges have been replaced. Uh, they've got a nice coating of, uh, looks like silver paint on them. Brand new Delco battery in this car. Beautiful restoration under the hood. All the paint on those inner fenders look good. Really sharp car under the hood. Boy, you get to the car show and pop the hood on this, everybody's going to be looking at this. Make sure you give Tommy a call. These black 57 Chevys do not last long. It's our most popular car with our most popular color on it. Give us a call at 248-974-9513. Let Vanguard Motor Sales put this one in your driveway. All right, Aubrey, let's go for a ride in this beautiful 57. The, hit, the heat definitely kicks in here, and it is a treat today to have a little heat in this 57. Beautiful running car, nice 350, just a gem to drive, guys. Don't miss out on the opportunity. Call me today at 248-974-9513 and let Vanguard Motor Sales park your dream in your driveway. And... Uh, don't forget at Vanguard, we own our inventory, so we saw these vehicles worthy for our inventory. That's why we purchased them. They're not consignment vehicles. And if you're on YouTube, please visit VanguardMotorsales.com and make sure the car is still in inventory on our homepage. Thanks again for joining us today. Stay tuned for the next pass.